Hello, hello, good morning, good morning. Hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to Enshrouded. Been a while, been about a month, I think. How are you all doing? I see a few people already here in chat. Hello, hello. Oh, poor shaman. The sun's not even out yet. <laughs> good morning. Thank you for being here. Hi, Alex. Hi, Mr. Dan. Hope you got your coffee. Tea, beverage of choice. Ooh. Yes, so there's been a few updates to this game. Uh, most notably, there are now dungeons. And we're going to try and attempt to go through one of those dungeons today. So, should be fun. Probably going to die. Uh, hi, Democracy Jones. How you doing? Good to see you. Hi, Ister. Thank you for the lovely uh, heart and the bee. Hope you're doing well. So, the updates. Um, we have a new quest with the alchemist, it looks like. So we'll go down and talk to him in just a moment. Uh, but they've added all kinds of things. Uh, one of the things that is pretty nice is uh, we can now make plant pots. And I've queued a few up here. Because, you know, who doesn't want to decorate their house with lovely plant pots? So we've got um, some sort of square looking ones, round, uh, long um, ones, small house plant type ones, and a large one there. So, uh, do I make them with her? I am not sure. Let's Here have a look. Go. Let me look. Yes, here we are. Here's all the options. Hi, Shaman. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> yeah, we've got all these lovely different options now. So the long flower pots look like they use a bit of metal and maybe you can put them up on a window ledge. So let's craft one of those. Um, small flower pots. Uh, let's try some different plants in these things. Tiny flower pots. These are so sweet. Let's have a purple one for that. Square flower pot. What haven't I used already? Let's have a, a fern for that one. And the medium one. And we'll get these placed in the house and then we'll go and talk to the alchemist and see what we've got to do. There we go. I've got a few things now. Thank you, Emily. Let's see where we can place these. We've already got our lovely flax garden here. I wonder, can we put them outside and above this uh, window here? That might be fun. I've got to get used to all the keys again now, unfortunately. Sorry about this. Okay, so first things first, let's switch over to that. We've got number seven. Ah, uh, yeah, looks like we might be able to fi fix these to the wall. Oh, yeah, you can see the little metal uh, metal hooks. Uh, I'm not sure if that's square, but I'm going to put it there. That's cute. Oh, yeah, hi, Jason. How you doing? Happy full eclipse day for us in North America. Good morning. Hope you're having a good day, too. All right, let's try and line this one up a little. A little easier. Oops. Okay, that didn't really work out. Let's get back up here again. And I'm falling. <laughs> that was weird. You know what? We're just going to eyeball this and it's going to have to be good enough. Uh, yeah, it might not be quite, quite level. That doesn't look too bad, does it? I like that. Okay, let me place the rest of these things around the, the uh, building and we'll get off and go and do something fun. Uh, so maybe we'll have this one here. And that one there. Yeah, they look cute. And we've got another one. Let's put it over here. Why not? I like that they've added this sort of stuff because uh, there were a lot of people trying to make these things work in a kind of a different way 
and uh, honestly it needed this level of decoration you can also sit in chairs now all sorts of things they've added so they are listening to the community can you hit x to smack the flower pots hi jade how you doing good to see you uh, yes, yeah, Sherman, I like the additions these make. The makes the base look less utilitarian. Exactly. I think it, it really adds something. Put that one there. We've got, what, one more of these? Let's put it on this corner. Why not? There we go. Pretty good. You could probably break them. Yeah, you probably could break them. Uh, okay, we've got, oh well, my goodness, we've got five of these little ones. Let's pop these down. I don't know why it makes five in a batch. That is a little odd. Uh, Easter saying, nice. Had no time to check out the update myself. Best plant pods ever. They are so cute. I'm going to put them all over the place, honestly. I'm going to have a little garden here. I'm going to put them in a little bit kind of ramshackle. I like the way their flowers are kind of grouped. I'm going to put a couple here. What else do we have? We've got some of these. These look a little bigger. Oh yeah, that's a big plot, uh, pot there. I'll pop that one down there. Put another one here in the corner. Got to have some flowers in the house. Let's have one up here by the uh, throne chair, which you can now sit in, which is awesome. Uh, we'll pop on down in the corner. Actually, you know what? I think I want to pick that up. Let's put one down on the uh, counter here. Uh, looks a little big, doesn't it? Let's put this one in the bathroom. You can sit on the toilet now, by the way, if you if you wanted to. Just saying. Let me show you. Look at that. Not that I think you would really want that as your screenshot, but still. Look how your um, uh, clothing drops down into the hole as well. It's pretty cool. Ah, uh, funny. Oh, to snap, Jason. Okay, oh, I gotcha. Okay. Did I did I read that out wrong? It's quite possible. Um, <laughs> wasn't quite with it when I uh, first logged in today. Uh, you do have um, ferns in the bathroom usually, don't you? So let's maybe pop a fern down there. Yeah, that looks really cool. And we'll put one on here, right by the bed. Very nice. I like these. They do look cute. Yeah, there's all sorts of things they've added, so I needed to see the sitting on the toilet. Yeah. <laughs> There's me sitting on the throne. And you can cook in all of the fireplaces now. They fixed that as well. Now, there is something I want to craft and I had it pinned. Let me go back into here. Workshops, I think, was it? In here. There's all kinds of things now that you can make. Um, decorative clutter. I want to make a um a blue globe. I think that would be cool. So we'll see how that goes. Let me come ahead of that and that. I made this. Um, where is it? I think I put it upstairs. Bear with me. Made this thing down here, which is supposed to be a fireball, and I was hoping that it would be on fire. <laughs> I think, but uh, obviously they've not gone that far. So, let's drop this one down here. I'll put it on this. Maybe they'll update it in the future. Yeah, but they keep adding stuff, so we'll see. We'll see what they add next. Okay, so I think that's all of the flowers. We've got one bowl left in the uh, in my inventory. We'll sort that out in a second. Let's go and talk to the alchemist and see what he has for us so what time is the eclipse um i know it's happening today i've seen a few posts about it but i i don't know what time it is hey 
Hey! Hello, Mr. Alchemist. What right. You hear, friend? Well, I need to descend into the hollow halls. Mm. By now you've encountered the hollow, skeletal husks animated by Aya and the curse of the flame. Legends say they were banished into grand underground halls of unknown origin. I discovered one such hall during my studies, but I could not enter. Maybe you can. Best assemble a team if you have one to descend. Now this is what I'm worried about. The fact that we might not be able to do this on our own, but we're going to give it a try. Let me see if I can actually craft one of these. I can. That's awesome. I need to see. <laughs> I'm just checking. Uh, Radiant Armor, hello. How you doing? How you doing? You know how it's done. Did you, you guys see this last time? This is the alchemy station. I don't know if I showed you this. So we can make our antiseptic and alchemical base in here now. Um, yeah. I don't know what I'm going to need all this stuff for. There's so much more crafting there as well. For me, it starts at around 10.30 a.m., so four more hours to go. Oh, lovely. So we'll be finished by the time that's all kicking off, so you won't miss anything. That's awesome. Oh, who wants me? Mr. Carpenter. Hello. Got my hands full, but what do you need? What do you need? Well. Ho, ho, ho. So are the ghastly catacombs that house the hollow are real? My aunt Ellen used to tell stories. But well, you know her. Always a tale teller, that one. If old Balthazar has seen them himself, then it is true. Oh, think of the materials, the architecture, the treasures. I wish my little legs could take me there too. Yeah, I think I'm going to need a companion. Have you got anything I need to craft? Nope, doesn't look like it. Cool. Happy to help. He's a cheerful fella, isn't he? Okay, so hopefully there'll be something on the map now we can uh, go and have a look at. I'm gonna have to. S oh, these look cute. Yeah, they're not quite aligned properly, but it's a rustic cabin. Oh, she wants to talk to me now. I'm good, how are you? Beware of the hollow. This is not looking very promising, is it? Hi, Blue Cat, how are you doing? Uh, my dear, the alchemist asks you to enter the hollow halls. Beware of the hollow inside. These thieves conspired to claim part of the flame and were cursed by the ancients as punishment to never feel the warmth of another. I almost pity them. Ooh, <laughs> that doesn't sound good. Come back soon. Are you going to ask me something now? You sure? Really? Right now, he says. Let me just make sure he's got nothing for me. Nope, that looks good. Uh, Shaman say, my work was crazy yesterday. We had been handing out free Eclipse classes, but ran out. People wait until the last minute. Oh my goodness. It's, it's going to be a big deal, I think, isn't it? Right, okay, we've done all that. I want to make sure that we have plenty of materials, um, food and, and healings and arrows and plenty of alternate weapons. Let's get these two things placed. Should we give, uh, should we give the hunter a, uh, a dish for the side of her? I think we should. It's just saying, uh, so it's like the crypts, but then at the lever of the elixir well, oh, maybe harder the way they warn you. Yeah, I'm a little worried. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I am a little concerned. But we are level 20 and the first dungeon is um, level appropriate for the um, biome that it's in. That's cute, isn't it? I like that. Uh, yes, yeah, so um, it's level appropriate for the biome that it's in. So hopefully we will be able to get through it with care. We'll have to see how we get on. All right, let's have a look on the map. Well, actually, let's check the quests first. What do we have? Explore the hollow halls. Okay, let's make that the active quest. 
So the alchemist revealed the location of some nearby hollow halls, grand underground crypts which serve as imprisonments to the hollow. Walking skeletal remains. Discover the location of the hollow halls in the Springlands and unmask the secrets they hide. Ah, so it's down here. So it's really not very far at all. Yeah, we'll go and do that one then. I've got this new thing where you can ping locations on the map as well, which is really cool. Uh, Tiana's saying, lol, quit looking at the sun, you'll melt your eyeballs. It'll be like Raiders of the Lost Ark, oh my goodness. Morning, Tiana, how you doing? Oh, by the way, I've got a shout out to uh, to do. Um, Blue Ophelia, hope you're doing well. Thank you for the support. I had a request for a little shout out. Lovely to have you uh, in the uh, comments. Right, should we sleep before we head out? I wonder what time it is. Do I need a fire? I wonder. Can I remember how to craft? That's the other thing. Uh, v for crafting. Campfire. So I will need a couple of wood logs. Okay. Yeah, we can sort that out. Let's grab some wood logs. I have an hour's worth of rested in here, so I'm really hoping that's going to manage to last for the whole of the journey through the uh, dungeon. But we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Yeah, we're going to get off to a quest. Uh, I don't think it's really going to matter whether we set off at night or wait to daytime. So, um, how is the best way of doing this? Let's see. I'm going to fast travel here and maybe we'll fly down. This is going to be exciting. There is already a spot for the new cross person. Yeah. They are locked behind the whole dungeon, unfortunately. Okay, so can I get to that from here? I should be able to. Why have I got... It's so odd. Bear with me. Explore the hollow halls. Set as waypoint. Okay. There we go. That's the way I've got to go. I hope it's not going to be in an enshrouded area. I need to eat. I'm, I'm aware that I haven't eaten anything yet. 701 in that direction. I think that's it. Where I'm above my head. Can you see it sort of set into the uh, mountain there? Okay, so I wonder if I've got enough food. Well, we'll see. Um, let me have one of you. And let me have one of you. And let me get this out. And um, yeah, I think we're going to go for it. Let's see how far we get. This is going to be uh, interesting, isn't it? Oh, I need to take that uh, craftable off the screen. I pinned it, didn't I? So... The blue globe there on the uh, right. I need to get that taken off. I'm pretty sure this is the hollow hall up here. If the end boss is like the wyvern, I hope we find the craftsperson before that, just in case. Yeah, I agree, Ista. Whee! Right, okay. Let's get this um, thing off my screen. Uh, crafting... I don't know. Let's pin and unpin. That should do it, I think. Yeah, we'll be good there. All right, we've got an hour, hour's worth of rested. This is going to be a bit of a race against the clock. Uh, 340 metres. Yeah, I think I was right. hope I've got enough health and everything. Mm, it's not there. I think it's that one up there. Okay. Yeah, of course I would head in into this at night time, wouldn't I? Does this look like it? I don't think this is it. No, this is the ancient vault. Oh, so where is this place? Okay, it's it's further south. Oh, God. 
Okay, let's quickly travel back home. Change of plan. We're going to sleep and head out in the morning. And I, I might get a few more drinks as well. I'm a little worried I haven't brought enough with me. Let me see if I can remember how to cook. I think I do it here with her. Craft. Energy, endurance. Uh, we could make some... Ooh, look at this. Endurance and stamina recharge. Yeah, let's make some of this. Let's make five of those. What does this make? Four health regen. Let's take a couple of those. Five endurance as well. Okay. Uh, backpack, what do I have? I could do with some more whatever this is. Vegetable soup and some more fruit. Okay. Fruit bowl. Make another two. And vegetable soup. Energy, dexterity. Ah, right. What am I missing here? Forest beets. No. Okay. Hi, Vector. Good to see you. How you doing? We're just prepping for a, uh, a quest. I am going to quickly sleep through the night. And then we'll head out and try and work out where this place is. Shouldn't take long. I love this, this space. It's so small, really, compared to some of them that you see. Just look comfy. Right, let's try this again. So... Is it best to just run round here, maybe? Can we run this way? I don't know. Yeah, well, I think we might be able to just run there. But let's let's try the um, flying again. Oh, it's going to be tricky. I'm really not too sure where I'm headed, so... Let's see. So last time I headed there, I think. Oh, is that it there? I think that might be it up there. Or maybe that where the top of my hat is there. I don't know why she stood up all of a sudden there. Yeah, let's go over here a little. Let me see if I'm pointing right at it now. No. Mm, so I think it might be that up on the hill, do you think? Yeah, maybe. I think it's that way. Okay, well, we'll get over the um, shrouded stuff. And uh, we'll see. Uh, we'll see if we can if we can reach can i get up any higher i can that might help a little so let me just make sure i'm heading the right way again yes okay right off we go still got an hour's worth of rested hopefully this works out uh can i yes i can go a little higher here i've got plenty of stamina Yeah, you can fly quite far with this um, glider, but not as far as you think you can. So, what do we think? There's a shrine down there. We could go and get that and then make our way up. Okay. Ooh, don't forget to, to actually fly. Let's go and tick this one off. I don't think I've been here before. Okay, so where are we now? So we've got to get up the cliff. There must be an obvious route. Follow the road, I guess. Kind of want to be up there. I woke up with a headache this morning. I, I defied my cardinal rule and slept longer than four to five hours. I slept seven hours. I would say you probably needed it. 
But that sucks when you wake up and you have a headache for the start of the day, definitely. I've got to try and be quick here because I don't want to lose this rested that I've got. Am I going the right way? I think so. We'll see if we can get around here. Hi wolves! How are you doing? Ah, look! Yes, this is looking promising. Well, there's a cave there. Location above. Okay, let's see if we can get up here. Hi Angie! How are you doing? Hi Tracy! Good to see you. We're checking out a little bit of uh, Enshrouded today. There's been a few new updates that I've missed and uh, we're going to try and do the Hollow Halls, which is a big dungeon. And I think this is going to be really tough work. Yes, this looks correct then. Wow, this looks formidable. Prepare for death. I think I'm going to die a few times in here. We'll see. It's the loot. There's books. It sounds spooky as. Oh, good, good, good uh, to hear, Angie. Still recovering with your uh, wrist, of course. Okay, well, we'll just take it a step at a time and we'll see what we can do. A new mystery unfolds. Okay. This is so spooky. Right, okay, off we go. My food seems to be going down very quickly. Do I need to collect any of this crap? No. Oh, I already see uh, enemies. Um, I've just realised what I didn't do in preparation. I did not prepare any bombs. Oh my goodness. I'm going to get through some heals today. Why am I, why am I covered in this stuff on my feet? Okay. Um, I need heals, please, game. Can you hit me from here? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Um, which uh, arrow do I want? Flint arrow, copper arrow, fossilized bone. Let's try the bone ones. Can I reach you from up here? Oh dear. Okay. Oh, where are you? Oh, that's spooky. Why are they doing that? Did you see that? Hi, you just disappeared, didn't you? Crumbs, okay. They're not, they're not that tough, but... They're not that tough once you finally get them um, and fight them, but that's pretty, pretty creepy. Oh, this is going to be, this is going to be a difficult battle, I think. Sacrificial mitts, oh no. Okay, well, off we go. The first little section is done. What we've got to do now, is this just to get into the, the damn thing? Oh no. There's no going back once we do this. Okay, off we go. OG, K9, how you doing? Good to see you. We're just heading into the, uh, the hollows. The hollow uh, dungeons is, um going to be interesting, I think. I'm going to try not to pull everyone this time. There's no way you can actually jump up and snipe people from, is there? Oh, they found me. Oh yeah, they found me. Mm. 
Okay, good, good. Comfort level 11. Threats nearby. Are they spawners? Do I need to take spawners and things down, I wonder? Or just keep fighting, I wonder. Hello. Can we, uh... Can we take any of these spools down? Try and do it at ranged a little. Yeah, we've got a few. Oh god. Come on. Stamina. Move. Stop standing in one place, please, woman. Let's seal a little. I can collect those bones, okay. Just gonna heal a little. I might run them around for a bit. They lost me. I think they've lost me. Rather than using all my heals. Yes, you can lose them. Okay, we'll collect those. We're going to need these bones, I guess. These feel, feel like a bit of a waste of uh, arrows on these, these things. Okay, you're down. I think there's another one around there somewhere. I think I can take one. Here comes the doggy. They're so creepy looking. I'm just looking to see if anything else is spawning in. Apparently there are spawners that you need to take out. Otherwise you get a bit overrun, but I don't know about that. Maybe it's those things on the left there. Should we see um, if I do alt? Is this a spawner? No, but you can you can dig the bones out. That's weird. Okay, it's so spooky. I'm loving it. Uh, right, what have we got here? Anything? No. Can I bash all of these and collect stuff, or do I just want to run through this? I wonder. Look at the skull. They've done a great job with the look and feel of this place. Oh, that looks creepy, doesn't it? Is there anything else I'm missing anywhere? No, I think, I think I've checked everything. I'll just head down here then to the next room. Oh. Hmm. Why can I not get in there? Have I not finished something, maybe? Hmm. Oh, maybe I've got to jump and get this. I think that maybe was the thing. No. Okay. What am I doing wrong? Is there something up on the top there? Maybe I've not read something. Let's go and have a look. You get a bone and you get a bone, everyone gets a bone, yeah. No. Uh, maybe this here? Oh, that's where I came in. Okay. I'm confused. Do I need a key? Anybody got any ideas? <laughs> maybe we're not going to be able to do this after all. Doesn't it look like there's a book here or something I'm supposed to read? I think that is just... decoration. What? Yeah, I don't know why I can't go in there. Journal, let's have a look. Gather a team. 
Look up. Okay. Look up. Oh! I, oh, I gotcha. Thank you! Goodness me. You, so you have to collect these things. Area unlocked. Oh my goodness. Thank you, Sarah. Oh my goodness. Thank, thank goodness you were here. I don't think I would have found that. Okay, so um, we're still okay on food. Rest is ticking down though, so let's not hang around. Oh my goodness. Yes, I did that. Let's heal back up again. Thank you. <laughs> right, next section. We are fully healed. I'm going to try not to get swarmed. Why are they running that way? <laughs> oh, God. Should I go left while well, they're over there, maybe? Let's go and see what's down here. That's spooky. I think this is a dead end, yeah. Yeah, well done, Sarah. Okay, there's nothing there. That's a door I can go through. Oh, great. Okay. Let's try not to die. These things are pretty tough. The little dogs anyway. Thank you for that. Oh, you are horrible. I'm just going to keep swinging until things go away. Oh, there's another one. Can I shut these doors again? Don't come in. Okay, I need to heal a little. I'm going to let them I heal, let my health tick back up. To my fellow flame keeper, uh, I am the reflection upon a slow river surface that beckons you forth. A noble yet familiar, a like yet different, an alluring call from the depths. Your new friend, okay. Anything here I should be collecting? I don't think so. Right, let's pick up these bits though. Need to find more glowy lights to open it. Thank you. Willow, thank you. <laughs> right, I'm fully healed again. My, my, my foods are doing a good job here. Let's go this way, I suppose. Morning. Hi, Th uh, Thor. How are you doing? Good to see you. No worries, we've not long started, honestly, so... I think I might get the bow out here. Try and take a couple of them out at least. Try and get round these bulls. Okay, they're all done. Yeah, there's more coming. Wait for my health. Come back. Don't you run in zigzags at me. Thank you. I need that dog. Whoops. Wasting arrows here. Yeah, let's back up a bit, just because he's going to be awkward here on the stairs. Nice, good. Okay. Couple of them done. Oh, this is so creepy. Right, there's, a, there's a room full of things over here. Oh my god, look how many there are! I'm getting swarmed. I'm running away. Run away. <laughs> Let's just go back in here for a sec. Let's try and thin it out a little because 
There's a lot of them coming. They do wait their turn, actually, so that's pretty cool. Come on. Thank you. Right, next one, please. You little bugger. Okay, and you next. Okay, we're good. Oh, right, okay. That thinned it out a little. Uh, Mr. Dan, hi, how are you doing? Jason, good to see you too. Uh, this dungeon kind of reminds me of Diablo 3. I've never played that. The amount of skellies, it is a lot for a single person. That's why they do say that you should bring a friend along. But I am playing this solo, so we'll see how we get on. They're not too difficult, these, these things here. Come on, hurry up, you weird pile of bones. Come on. That is actually hurting me. Oh, get out of there. Hang on a second. Let's seal up again. We'll bring them down the corridor a little. I'm using the um, regen, the health regen, rather than using all my heals up, but I might have to use a potion in a second. Come on. Yeah, we're good. Okay. You want to check all closed caskets, you may get help helpful drops. Okay. I don't think I've seen any yet. Not sure. Alright, let's make sure we top up on food and stuff. Can I drink and eat and do any of this stuff? Right, we're good. My rested is ticking down, which is a bit awkward. Apparently these things take a few hours to get through, these dungeons, so we'll see. Okay, that wasn't too bad, I guess. No scary music. We do not want scary music. There was one in the little room earlier. Oh god, okay. Shall I go back for that before I get too further, much further in? You can get a skeleton thing fighter, can't you, to, to fight for you, I think. In here? Closed caskets. Ah, are these them? Oh yeah. God, I completely missed all this stuff. Right, okay. I know what I'm looking for now. Uh, e. Shroud survival flask. I'm not sure if I'm going to need that, but we'll grab it. I didn't bring any stuff like that with me. Staff charges. And that's open. Right. Thank you. <laughs> I have a name for Mitz's followers. Mitz Mittens. Oh god, okay. <laughs> have I gone the wrong way back? I was reading charts. Bear with me. Let's have a look. Yes, I think I need to go this way, don't I? Smash all the pots too. I haven't got a lot of time. I've only got 40 minutes rested and I do not want to run out of that. Um, especially alone. I mean, if I had people with me, a uh, different matter. Definitely. Oh my god! Okay, block that one. That's a must. Definitely need to be blocking some stuff, that's for sure. Come here, you. Uh, we'll have you. Okay. Good grief. Okay, that was better. Uh, I get it, but the pots usually have lots of healing. Okay, good. Good point. Yeah. I'll see if it's feasible at some points. Oh, God. Oh, 
damn it. Come on, get these feathers down. Okay, not bad, not bad. Uh, let's search that quickly before he comes over. I'm hiding here. I'm waiting for my heels. You can stay over there, fella. Thank you. Oh, you bugger. Right, okay, so they're important to take out then. Otherwise he spawns those things. Where are you going? Come back, you little cowards. Come back. Oh, that was so funny. That's nice to know. These are much weaker, aren't they? Okay, what we got here? Oh god, we have a baddie over there. That one we can take out with an arrow. Don't do this at level 10 as they are, they are. <laughs> it is tough. It is very tough. Let's go up here and see what there is. Ah, I can repair my equipment. Thank goodness. Okay, I need to loot you. Grab you. Okay, next level. And we've got a check uh, checkpoint. Thank goodness. Okay, so if I die, I'll be back here. Uh, I do see a little bit of that red marble. And some more here. Yeah. Uh, a bit of wood, maybe? Twigs? Yeah, a bit more marble. Okay, right. Let's go for it. Next level. Okay, we've got a dog there. A couple of skellies come in. Quite a few. Oh my gosh. Right, not. St oh no, get out of here. Get out of here. No. Oh god, okay. This is bad. Let's heal up. I am, I'm going to take a bandage this time. Woo, they are tough. Right, let's thin them out again. Come on. Okay, you're down. I like the way they walk off <laughs> once they're done with you. I don't know why that did that when I'm trying to search this. Okay, there we go. That's easier. Good grief big skeleton in one of those areas that can one shot you okay thank you dr deathwish good to see you come on you can come to me you two okay all right let's get you quickly because much easier if I kill you first. Barrier unlocked. Okay, good. Whew. Right, stuff is good. Yep. Oh, look at you. You're creepy. You must... You must have got stuck. Oh no, that doesn't sound good. That you up there, okay. Can I, can I shoot you from here? Come on. Come on. Another one. Okay, thank God. Okay. Woo! Oh, did you tell them where I was? Creepy flying skull thing. 
Let's just check down here. Is there anything that way? It doesn't look like it. How's my health? Health is okay. I'm gonna eat, I think. Let's take some more food. Okay, we should be good. Let's carry on to the next uh, section. Uh, I agree, Jason. Uh, this game has a lot of Zelda Breath of the World feel. Um, they said they were inspired by it in a, uh, a blog that they did. Oh. Oh, well, I don't like the look of that. Do I have to go that way? Surely not. Oh, man. What? There's no coming back from that, is there? Is there no other way to go? You know I'm going to have to fly down there and then I'm going to fall all the way to the bottom because I am rubbish at flying. Let's have a look from here. I could fly onto that bit, I think. Yeah, let's try and get onto those bones, shall we? Good grief. Do I have to? I know. Well, let's go for it. Okay. Not bad. <laughs> I'm staying up here, can I? Oh, it looks like we've got to get across to those two things and they've kind of handily put some chains in the way, haven't they? Okay, first one. I see bats. I see bats. Now how do I get across to that one? You can do it. Thank you, don't you? I'm not sure I can, but thank you. Oh, this is tough. Can I get up onto this pot, I wonder? What I'm thinking is, I'm like, oh no! Oh, thank God I pressed that. No, what am I doing? No, did you see what I did there? Like an idiot. I just pressed the down button instead. Rocky mistake there. I'm gonna have to try and get back up here. Oh no. Um. Okay. Well, actually, look, I've got a. <laughs> that's a lot of flying. I hate flying. I mean, I, it's okay. I'm not that bad at it, but... Oh, I know what I'm doing. I'm pressing space as I'm flying. Okay, let's try not to do that. I'm holding space as I'm flying instead of um, just jumping across, you know? So... Okay, that's that one. I needed to get that anyway, so... I planned that first time. <laughs> Oh gosh. Anything in the pots that might help. Let's get up here. I always press the wrong button and when I'm flying. I do. Uh, oh god, I've got to get all the way back up there. Oh, E. Oh, hello. Right, come at me one at a time, please. I don't want a big bunch of you, thank you. Oh no! Okay, run away for a minute. Let's go and get our bearings again. Oh! Look at this stuff on my feet! Rude! Yeah, let's split this up a little. Okay, he can't reach me from there. That's good. Well, he kind of can. Okay, that could have been worse. That could have been much worse. I hate the way that I flew and fell all the way down. So, have I missed anything that I can't get back to? I've got to get up to that one there. Okay. Um, ooh, I can open this one. Uh, take all. A bone channel. Hmm... Okay, let's 
it's got to be a more obvious way of doing this. Let's see. That's too high, isn't it? Yeah, that's too high. Uh, any grapples anywhere? Can't really see anything. I see a grapple over there. I could maybe jump up onto this. And I walk over here. Can I double jump up there, do we think? Yes, yeah, stop! Don't fly! Stop it! <laughs> oh, God. Oh, right, okay. So, that and that. Now we've got to do that thing down there. Um... Okay. Yeah, I think I can just... <gasps> Whoa! No, stop, stop flying. Okay. We're good. Let's get this one. You're blown. What are you doing here? You lose the others, did you? Alright, what's next? There's another one in front of me. You have to be careful in the lower dungeon because you had to fly in be between big piles of bones over the pink mist. Oh, God. Uh, good game, Mitz. Always cheesing the jumps like in Raft. I know. Remember when I found a way of um, getting up through a parkour section? And the other guys were spending ages looking around trying to get through a series of jumps and I found an accidental way of climbing up a wall. I love it when that happens because I'm rubbish at this. Do we think I can get this? Yes, so there's still another one to find I think. Anybody got any ideas? It must be back in that other section. Oh my gosh. What? Okay. Careful look around now. So, where do we think this next one is? Let's have a look the other side. I think the game's being pretty generous with me right now. Let's go this way. So now we know we can get back up here. Anybody see what I've missed? Drop down. I'm missing one somewhere. This is where my rested is um, just ticking away now. And that means my stamina is going to be shot soon. I'm not seeing anything anywhere, are you? So we did this before. Okay. What am I missing? I did those two up there. We went up here. Up on the bridge. Up on the bridge. Oh, up there. Oh god, okay. Oh, I see. There's a grapple. Thank you. I would have found it eventually, but thank you. I appreciate that. Is this where we fell down originally or probably something yeah I sh something I should have um, got rid of at the beginning and of course I uh, I missed it because I fell down didn't I oh these are spooky hello hi and uh, now of course it wants me to do that right okay Oh, look how they're, like, electrify, electrifying the, uh, the ground there. Uh, okay. So, let's get back down here. I'll drop and kind of fly and hit the wall. That seems to work well for me. You missed something in the coffin back there. I'm not going back for it. <laughs> but thank you. 
have to have eyes on a swivel, you do. This is spooky. Right, health's good. Uh, weapon's not bad. I could do with repairing, but hopefully they'll give me something in the in the next place. Okay, we've got a save point. Squeaky door. Is that a way we've got to go? Oh, spikes, goody. Repair! Thank you. So we've got some twigs here. In case I want to make a fire, I guess. I am getting more rested from this area, but not as much as I had before. Oh, there's a potion. I'll have that. Let's see if there's anything else. Loads of little details in this game now. It's pretty cool. I would keep wood on hand so you can have fires. Yeah, I did bring some. Um, I bought some logs so I can make a fire later. Run, run, run. Okay. Oh, great. Okay, well, I'm committing myself here. This is not too bad, I guess. Oh, no, look what's ahead, though. Whoa! Oh, my goodness! Did you see that? Don't hit those things. Whoa. I'm going to take a bandage as well, there. Wow, they hurt. I should have done that a little more carefully. Break the urns, lots of goodies. I know, but... I'm running out of rested. Right, you come here. Right, you growl at me. Really? Good gods. Oh, ghosts. Get him quick, quick, before he stands up again. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to need heals after this. Oh, not too bad. Not brilliant, but not too bad. Break the urns, you say. Okay, um, I guess I can in this little section. Let's have a look. Well, nothing in that one. Oh, you bugger! You were hiding! That's funny. That's what I get for breaking the urns, obviously. Let's try one more. Nothing in the urns here. Okay, another door. Yeah, I've got I've got some um, I've got logs. I'm good for logs. You bugger off. Okay, come here, doggies. Bad doggies. I don't like the way the camera zooms in a little there. Ooh. Wait, where did you go? Come here. Thank you. Okay. Good. I don't know why I'm running into these areas. Um, did you lose your friends? Okay, they're not too bad. We'll grab that. I guess these are the ones maybe that have got stuff. Was that a full heal? I think I've got a full heal there. Ooh. Um, yeah, let's go for this first. Oh, no. There are baddies down here. Hi! Hello! Oh, he doesn't look very... very nice to see. Okay. Yep, yep. Plus these two in here? What's this? Ring of stamina? Really? 
What do I have on at the moment, my character? I have the alchemist ring. Nope, I think I will keep that. That's not a very good drop, was it? Oh, this button. We've got a button. Okay. All right, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. I really hope there's not too much flying next. I really don't like the flying. Uh, right, we've got a book here to read. Come hither. Uh, okay, we've got another door there. We've got a gate here. I guess that's back around, so maybe we'll do this door first. Do not stop breaking the jars. They do hold po potions. Okay. Can I not get through you? Right, okay, we've got to go this way then. Try another, another one. Nothing in that one. Uh. Okay. Seems that I keep getting baddies in my my uh, jaws. Let's just do a couple here. Oops. Get closer. Yeah, look, I keep getting the enemies. Okay, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not going to break anymore now. You want a house that looks like this, but a lot cleaner. Yeah, I'm with you, Jade. Pretty impressive. Nice high ceilings. Could do without the ambience, though. Uh, bone meal. Great. Uh, repair. You have only got 20 minutes rested left again. Okay, what have we got down here? These places are massive, aren't they? Oh, this looks like another one of the big open area ones, doesn't it? With tons of things in. Get up here before we... Uh... Am I back where I was? Is this a new place? There's no map, is there? No, I'm just in the dungeon. It is uh, random, but they do hold large potions. Oh, I'm just going to run in for this fella. Oi! Oh no! Oh, I'm stuck. I'm actually, I'm actually stuck in place. That's that uh, ice stuff, isn't it? That they're... Or whatever it is that they're hitting me with. Let's bring them back here again. Just because it's safer than me falling down. My God, look at them. What the... Let's get through these. This sword is doing some good work, I've got to say. Uh, thank you, Angie. Yeah, if you could press that like button. I don't know whether my um, stream deck is working. It is. Oh, thank you. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can pick off this guy. Who's the, the real baddie here? Mm, woken all you guys up, haven't I? Yeah, I really don't want to get knocked off this bridge. <laughs> Go away. There's a guy. Oh! oh, no. Okay, let's go this way, I think. Um, no. Run away. Too many. Let's let them catch up slowly. Try and thin it out a little. There's so many. Oi. 
Stop it. Okay. Oh, Jump. hello. They don't notice you sometimes, which is pretty good, but this they have now. Let's run past these fools. Try and get him when he's least expecting it. Just keeping an eye on my health here. That's right, you run, sucker. Oh, okay. That worked, that worked okay. Right, okay. Did you see all those things that were waiting for me? So many of them. Hi. Oh, hello. Oh no, they're all down here, aren't they? It kind of launches you towards the next group, even though you might not be ready for them. Right, okay, I'm just gonna run back up here for a second. And just let myself heal. Wow. <laughs> it is wise the next time you play this area to carry at least 60 health potions. No. I'm not going to play this again, possibly. <laughs> we'll see. It's not too bad so far. I mean, I only bought 20 with me. So... I've picked up a couple, I guess. But I'm, I'm doing okay, I think. I think backing off and letting letting them sort of splinter themselves into smaller groups is definitely the way to go. Alright, let's see what we've got next. Which way are they going to be? There's a couple of bones down there. Yep, yeah, okay. Let's grab these things, I suppose. Oh, poor dog bones. It's not nice. Alright, we've got another one of these. What? Oh, right, okay. He was quite loud, wasn't he? Oh, hi. I tried to block him then. Okay, we're good there. We're good there. Let's go in here. One side is a dead end. Okay. Please give me something better this time. Another mace. Okay. Don't use two-handed weapons game. Alright, let's go back up here then. Should I try and smash a few pots? What do we think? Please don't give me enemies. Okay, one potion. Could do those ones in there. I'll just do these big ones here. Mana potions, yeah. Yep, yeah, I'm not going to bother with anything else just for now. Okay, I guess it's this way next. Uh, oh, these fellas. Um, let's get inside here. Are you coming? You are coming, okay. I think if you kind of go aggressively after those, it's easier than waiting for them to hit you. Okay, you do your thing. And now I'm going to hit you. Like that. And um, thank you. You two come back here. Those are really spooky, those um, floating bones. Okay, so what we got next? There's a door there and a door there. Sorry if I'm not looking at uh, chat as much. Uh, you can destroy the weapons you don't want for runes. Yeah, I've been playing a, 
Oh well, I've got quite a few runes from uh, stuff I've dismantled. That's where I got most of them from, honestly. Ah, oh, I could have gone up and over and then sniped them. Ah, okay, I need to be aware of that for next time. Thank you, Dr. Deathwish. Nothing that way. Let's maybe go up here this time. <gasps> no way! No way! You see how many were there? Oh no! Oh god. Um... This is, this is a lot. Oh my god, so many. Oh, thank you. What did you do that for? Oh, I see you've... Right, okay, I'm going for you. You can pack it in. Oh god, so many of these things everywhere. Uh, yeah, I thought there might be one coming after me. Okay, it is a skelly parade. So many of them, my god. But one player. <laughs> That's a lot. Oh, yeah, I didn't mean to do that, but yeah, it's a good idea, probably. Have a seat. Alright, so... Where were we looking? We were looking down here next. See how many more there are. Oh, hi. Whoa, okay. I may have aggroed them all. There's, there's ones with... There's ones with flags or big uh, scythes or something by the look of it. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is not good. Fly. Fly, my pretty. Stop it! Get out of here! Get out of here now! Let's seal up again. Oh no, don't wake them up. Uh, right, okay, I need that. Oh no, don't you dare, I was healing. That's not fair. Number seven. Oh no! Do you know what? Let me get a weapon out, actually. That would be good, wouldn't it? Oh, there's so many of them! Thank God I've still got some stamina. What can I do here? I'm going to have to just stop and fight a few of them, I think. You know what? Let's back right off. Let's go through here where it's flat and there's nothing to fall off and maybe we'll get a few coming through one at a time. Stop that. Yeah, he's he's all wounded off now, can you see in the distance? So let's pick a few of these off with maybe some arrows and stuff. Give me a breather. Are uh, you coming now? Okay, now the rest of them have found me. Come on. Okay, that's a few. I got rid of a few. Okay, what I don't want to do though is get myself stuck. Um, in an area that I can't jump out of. You saw, I kind of got myself trapped a little bit. I've only got six minutes rested now. This oh no, I didn't want to do that. Oh well. That's all good. Right, let's uh, pick off a few of these because they've kind of stranded themselves around and about. I've got arrows, I may as well use them. I don't like the big scythe guys, I've got to say. They didn't look very good. You coming up? Alright, let's get this ready for you then. 
Did you get bored already? Got downstairs. Yeah, you're down there. You're stuck. Okay. Yep, I'll take that. I don't care. All right, what have we got going on over there? Is that one of the big scythe guys? Nice. Okay, if I can get the others like that, that will help me. There's another one over there somewhere. I can't quite see this one. That's the problem. He's just out of sight. Listen to the noise they make. It's gross. Uh, of course you found me. Come on then. Stop it. Thank you. I've right, got another one here. Mm-hmm. Okay, can I see... I want to see if I can find that big scythe guy over here. I can see him just about. The angle's all wrong. Let me see if I can snipe him before anybody notices me, though. Because he looks nasty. I'm going to hold my ground here. Nope, can't. Got to run. Let me run back again. Sorry guys, this is a lot of back and forward, but I think this is safer. Yeah, I'm going to jump down here again. Give me some distance. Let them come to me. I do need a stag breaker, it's true. I like this more than beating the uh, wyvern, Ista. Yeah, I like the wyvern once I figured out what to do. Right, what's going on here? Why didn't they follow me? Come on. You're getting wise to my plans. I like the way they turn round and then then howl at each other. Let's try and get a few of these down. Do they just keep coming? Oh nice, you're stuck. That was interesting. I wonder if they keep coming and uh, I'm actually doing myself no good here. Wait, where is that one? That's the one I need to get down, that one there. He looks nasty, like this guy, no! <laughs> I didn't see him sneak up on me. Come on. Oh, nice. Are you, uh, are you all confused? I'll take advantage. I don't care. Come on. I'm gonna do another. Mmm, I don't like these guys. I'm running away for a second. Sorry. Again. Ah, uh, okay. Let my health tick back up again. Yeah, let's run him over here. Maybe you'll get bored. No, he's not bored. Oh, maybe he's bored. My weapon's nearly broken, have you noticed? Can I find somewhere to repair? Uh, is it back here? In here? Let me just check. I need to repair my... Um, my weapons. Nice. Good. There's a spawner you need to break. Oh no, Jade. Dr. Deathwish, look down below you in front of the bone pile on that ledge. Destroy the glowing bone spawners. Okay. Oh, great. So, yeah, they are going to keep coming. Oh, uh... Come 
Wow, he's tough. Look at this. Oh, thank God. Okay. Right, let's grab with you. Anything good off you? No? Let's go and see if we can see what these bone spawners are then. Oh no, you're kidding. Is that what these are? These things? No! Oi! Stop it. Okay. So, maybe this? Is this, this a bone spawner? Surely not. Doesn't feel like it is, but just the fact that he happened to come out of there. <laughs> okay. Oh no, I did it again, damn thing. Okay, we got that guy down there. They're stuck, definitely. Oh, hi. Glowing bone spawners, okay. glowing bone spawners i guess that's those things there right i gotcha these things i see no not not exactly that oh no run away oh no what am i doing alt there we go i don't think that was the right thing by the way You know what would be nice is just a minute just to have a look around and see what what it is. These things maybe? I don't think so. Three spikes coming out of the ground. These? These. None of these are breaking. Hmm, let me read. I don't think there are any spawners in this dungeon. They just start appearing in the next one. There is a set number in here, just lots behind doors. Thank you, Jason. Okay. No more rested. I know. Um, what I might do, I think, if I'm right, the flame thing gives you rested. So let's run back to that very quickly. Green glow in the center. Okay. I'm pretty sure. I've got no warmth. I could make a fire. Uh, crafting, campfire, craft, backpack. Let's get that placed somewhere near me. Number seven. That'll do there. Okay, that's better. Backpack. Let's put those bone arrows down here. What have we got? We got all sorts of good stuff. A bone scourge mace. Melee weapon, level 10. Bone arrows. Got 15 of those. I've got this thing, which is, um, it throws the skull um, thingy down for you to fight for you. They are as tall as you, the spawners are. A green glow in the center. I didn't think there were any spawners. Mm, okay, I'm not sure. Um, anyway, I've got 20 uh, rested now, so that's good. Can I dismantle that and take it with me? No, I can cook stuff, though. Right, let's make sure we eat. I'm doing okay so far. But it would be nice to know if there is something I should be destroying, but we'll see. Um, take all. 
Okay, let's just go for it because we've been in here so long already. Uh, by the way, we have 50 people watching right now. Thank you so much for joining me today. 59 likes. Thank you, everybody. Very kind of you. Right, let's pick up some of these things, shall we? It feels like I've I've already got these guys. I think they're all down already. We'll see. The big scythe guys are the ones that really worry me the most. These do a lot of damage, these bone arrows. Fossilized bone arrows. Okay, pretty good. I think there were only a couple of those, so I'm happy in there now. Hi, Skelly, you doing a dance? Come on. Come on, get yourself down here. Hurry up. I haven't got all day. Why have I got uh, dramatic music? <laughs> One Skelly. Really? Okay, that's that done. Oh, look behind me. They all spawned in again. Actually, to be honest, I'm quite turned around. The next room does not look pleasant either. But yeah, they've all spawned back in again. Oh, this is a lot to deal with, I was just saying. Um, I need to heal. <laughs> I need to heal. Oh, and they caught up with me. Okay. Wow. Okay. This is a lot of threats nearby, I know. I'm just running them around in circles right now. They do get bored and wander off, which is quite handy for me. Okay, we've got another guy over there. Too bad there's no long stick you can bop the nose of a skeleton and say no! Wait, you come back here, you. Okay. Those ones are horrible. Oh no, that fella's back. Man, this sucks. There's so many in there. Oh, I see the guy with the skelly, the with the scythe coming. Oh no, this is never, never going to end, is it? Comfort level four. Oh my god, look at them all after me. Can I just leave them and run away? I'm going to have to kill them all. I know I am, but. This is a lot of them to deal with on my own. He's angry. He's very angry. Oh. Damn it, I was too slow. I wanted to get him going back around the corner. Level up to 21. Okay. Um, let's get this guy. Like I said, he's horrible, that, that red um, scythe guy. What? Okay, time to move. You come up here on your own and I'll maybe have a fight with you, but you keep bringing all these fellas with you. Damn it. Okay, let's get down here. Come 
come up. Get him, get him. Okay, finally got him stunned. He's a lot to take out. No. Okay. Oh my god. This is this is tough. Can't pick you up. Nope, can't pick you up, okay. Right, let's go back. Oh, Alpha, hello, how you doing? I've got to get back to work, enjoy the stream, everyone. Enjoy the stream, it's... Uh, I'll be glad when this is over, <laughs> I'll tell you. What happened is there are four rooms in four corners and they are open and some sort of trigger. That's where why they seem to respawn. And she cleared the area and then it disappeared off the screen. Sorry, I missed that bit. Let's try again. Oh, I don't want to fall down there. I do not want to fall down there. Okay, I'm just going to have to really just go for it. Let's go this way. This is open now and it wasn't, was it? There's a chest and a couple of uh, skellies in here. Okay. Let's see if we're lucky with some uh, loot drops here. Oh, red marble, I could maybe throw it at them. Okay, we got the building block. Uh, I think all the rest of those are closed, aren't they? Do I need to repair my um, weapon again? Let's just run through to the other side. Oh no. You bugger off. That's not fair, there's one behind me. Okay, let's see if we can get this guy with the um, arrows. What are you doing in there? You know I want that chest. Not really getting much of a headshot on this guy. Thank goodness. Okay, they're horrible. Barrier unlocked. So it was those fellas I needed to take out. The ones with the reds, maybe. Enough of those and then you can get through the barrier. Maybe, maybe. Uh, whoever said ladies can't fight, lol, go mid. <laughs> Thank you, Deanna. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, let's search this fool. And let's see what we get. Okay. Ooh, another building block. That's nice. So that's the red marble, I guess, that I've been picking up. I knew a bone guy named Robert. Strangest nickname, though. Hi, disgruntled we. How you doing? Good to see you. Right, let's mop these fellas up. Surprise! Right, loot, please. Uh, right, we've got you. Loot while, uh, loot while I can. Oi! Stop it! I know I'm not blocking and I should be. Oh, look, more of these fools. Ah, let me get out of here for a second because I need to heal. Oh, dear. Okay, let's do A number seven. Oh, no, there's loads of things over there. I can get through now, though, can't I? So... So many skellies. The ones in Valheim are not going to be very difficult after all. After this, I tell you. Why are you in here? Okay. I'm a bit worried my sword's going to break. I might need to run back and get it repaired if there's nowhere to repair in here. Which I know might reset everything, but I don't think I have a lot of choice. They had the runes above their heads. Yeah, I think that's what it was. Uh, can I go... 
Where was the repair thing? It was up high, wasn't it? Not in here. Sorry, my weapon is almost dead, so... Uh, back in here? Hopefully? Yes! Okay, right, we've lost our rested again. I guess I could sit back down again. That'll give me another 20. Thank you, Dr. Deathwish. <laughs> the repair station is where the glowing stone room was. Thank you. Uh, too bad uh, there's no magic power to bring in a crane with a wrecking ball. <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh, that's very kind of you. Mitz is the best fighter I've seen. Uh, never gets hit, just looks like she, <laughs> like she does. Each area has one. Cool. Right, well, the new barrier is open, so let's try and make some progress, even if there are things to fight. I'm thinking of just running through this next section, so let's see. 20 minutes rested doesn't feel like an awful lot. Oh, right, we've got um, a guy down here with a rune. Let's get him. He's down. Barrier unlocked. Okay. This side? I think I went this way, didn't I? Yeah. Oh, hi. You're evil looking. Big battle music now. Oh, no. Look at them all over there. Okay, well, let's go for it, I guess. Come on. There's not that many here. Okay, we'll grab you and you. A couple of dogs here. Okay, come into a nice group for me, please. Oh, it's a flurry of blades. <laughs> Did you hear my person say? <laughs> Might heal after this, actually. We'll see. If they give me a minute, I'll let my um, passive healing just tick up, but... It doesn't seem to give you a breather. Let's grab this. Quick look in these rooms, just make sure there's nothing. There is a chest. I'll grab. I've already got. Okay. Everything looks the same. It's not very, um, distinct, is it? Between areas. Uh, I really thought I'd mess that up there. Okay, another thing. More blocks. Okay, hope these look good. Ice bolts. Uh, anything to read? No, just glowy red. Okay. That's open. That one's open. Okay. Alright, let's try and make some progress to the next area, which I think is this way. Okay, spooky. What is this? Alden Crowley, the collector. Did I do it? Or at least I've got the person, at least. Well, that's cool. What are you? Anything I can pick up? Uh, lots of bits and pieces. Any potions? Anything to repair my weapon on? Nope. Uh, looks like there is another section, unfortunately. 
Well, that looks like he suffered. There is a, a weapons thing. Yay! It's not giving me the blueprint, it's giving me the blocks. That's why I'm getting so many. I getcha. Okay. Can I go now, please, game? I think I've seen enough skellies today. A wand? A nice wand, okay. Uh, and yeah, there's a teleport there. Oh, that's awesome. Shall we, uh, shall we break a few parts, see what we get? Uh, yep, we got a bit of marble. Some potions, may as well, while we've got time, while it's quiet. Bit of water, we've got a chest thing here, a tomb, whatever they are. Casket. Anything round the back? Oh, there's a pot, pot there. And this one, nothing. That's open, got some more pots here. Oh, full heal, thank you. Oh! Full heal and then covered in spiders. Ugh, that's kind of mean, isn't it? Another full heal. Why do they give you all of that when you're just about to, well, hopefully leave? Nothing. I think there's another. Nope, nothing. Okay. We're all good. Oh, there's some more pots there. Uh, did I not get... Is that open? That's open, yep. Oh! Oh! No! Mean! Mean game! It's like, surprise! Okay, awesome. Now I don't know if this is like the final level or this is out. I'm really hoping this is out. Oh my goodness. Morning Josh, sorry. Hello. How you doing? Ooh, look at that up there. The sound on that's fantastic. Location above. I think this is the exit. I'm hoping. Oh no, why does it make that noise? Stop. It's scary. Oh yeah, this is the exit. Thank goodness. I did it. <laughs> I didn't die. Woo. Oh, thank goodness. That wasn't too bad. How long have we been going? An hour and 49. So maybe take off 10 minutes, 15 maybe. About an hour and a half. Oh, thank you everyone. That's pretty good. I don't think it was too bad. I think having an hour rested at the beginning definitely helped. I, thank you, Seb. Uh, Seb sent screen. Welcome. Good to see you. Yeah, about an hour and a half, I think. Solo. First level dungeon. Uh, do, uh, do my people want to speak to me about anything? Let's go and see. Don't think. Keep it brief. Okay. Well, rude. You've not got anything new. I don't oh, think there's anything, anything new, honestly. Let's have a look. So completed and where is that quest? Wow, look at all these we've done. Looking for the hollowed. Did I miss it? Explore the hollow halls. Oh, okay. Oh, we've got to um, bring him now. Okay. I gotcha. Keep it brief. Where there's a certain 
It's a loot that fits this occasion, yeah. Um, amazing, amazing job. Thank you, John. Thank you. Uh, your house looks great. Oh, thank you, Seb. That's very kind. It's only a starter build, but um, I'm pretty pleased with the roof and stuff. What? Uh, oh, <laughs> it's quite a complicated roof. Uh, it was a smaller build and then we added bits on and kind of extended. But uh, yeah, it's it looks interesting, I think. And we've got a little dungeon for all our people down here. Which is fun. And the alchemist is in here because he's a bit creepy, let's face it. Hi! Yeah, none of them would have talked to me now. All right, let's get back upstairs then and we'll uh, we'll bring in our new person. Actually, do I want to, where do I want to put this guy? We'll put him down in the uh, in the basement because I reckon we could build him the crypt walls um, which we've got. Make him a little a little area of his own. Maybe put him next to the alchemist for now. Yeah, thank you everyone. That was fun. I, I really honestly was worried that it was not going to stop. At one point I was convinced we were going to get into real trouble. Do I put him next to the carpenter or with the alchemist? Let's put him in here. When you get new equipment though, we're going to struggle, aren't we? I could put a little doorway through and make him a little bone section. Let's put him down here. So, tab, and uh, we need Alden Crowley, the collector. Ah. Oh, he's spooky. <laughs> yeah, put him in the in the dungeon and lock the door. Hi, Wolf Club, how you doing? Hi, Jason. Oh, you're going now, sorry. You've got to go. Great stream. Well, thank you. It was fun doing that uh, dungeon. That was fun. Um, right, okay, let me get out of this and I want to move that out of my hand. What was this wand I got? Snake Spine Wand, mid-range, level 10. Not a great one. These are the new blocks, Hollow Halls blocks. And I think we got... Did we get something else? We maybe unlocked a blueprint for something else. Have a look at that in a second. Ah, fresh air fills my tired lungs. I greet thee, new friend. I am a ferryman. Keeper of souls, a guide in the night. How lucky for you, aimless one. I will light your path. You trade, I listen. Ooh, he's got a spooky voice. Oh, dear. Uh, Deanna saying, uh, people generally warn off uh, others off about thinking they can get away with anything because I don't hit like a girl and I have a scary kick your butt face. <laughs> you go, Deanna. Like it. Before we read his law, let's have a look at what we can craft here. So we need a Revelwood bone key. Well, let's craft one of those because we've got the stuff on us. I bet that's for the next hollow hall. Uh, bone channel uh, staff charges. Call upon the forces of the underworld to summon projectiles that seek out enemies. So a bit like in Guardians of the Galaxy with the little whistly thing. Maybe. So you get 20 of those. The skull summoning vessel. Throw this mys mystical vessel to temporarily summon a skull companion. That's cool. It can make bone arrows. Um, 14 damage, so not that great. But you get 50 of those. And an ectoplasm gem. Faceted gemstone made from refined frozen ectoplasm. wonder what you use that for. Oh, and we can make, oh nice, a large crypt table plus three comfort. A medium crypt table. Oh, look at the skull. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's nice. They're giving you a few things. So we'll make him a little crypt area. Um, I like that chair. Let's make an exoplasm gem. 
Oh, now I've done that. I've unlocked some more stuff. I want this. One ectoplasm gem. Wow, that's cool. Crypt standing torch and a wall torch and a candle. Cupboards. <laughs> Who'd have thought you would make you would make that trip down to the uh, dungeon and then you get a cupboard out of it? It's so funny. Oh, they're quite cool though. Sideboard and yeah, shelves. They're spooky. Very nice. Cool. Okay, that's good. All right, let's talk to this guy then. The collector at your service. I'm free at last, thanks to you, my friend. All names are fleeting. Just sound and smoke. I've as many as an hourglass as grains of sand. To you I will be olden. I am the light that beckons downstream. A fading star behind the north winds. A collector and breaker of earthly chains. I shall part the veil for you once you're ready. The toll is little, I promise you, friend. Oh my god, look at all of these! He is so spooky. He's like a Doctor Doom, isn't he? <laughs> I gotta say. The manacle hollow are driven by resentment. They must be set free. Return to the winds of fate. Slash through their white hot anger. Crack their pale fingers like wishbones. Pluck the gold teeth from their jaws and bring me the head of one eyed beast in their midst so we may drink from its skull. Gather your might and craft the key to descend. Oh, I'm not sure I'm ready for another one today. Mm -hmm. The people follow your lead, bright-eyed friend. Why? I see a pulsing light inside your ribcage, held by flesh and bone. Interesting. Perhaps you've done as I could not, flameborn, they call you. So the flame bestows both blessings and curse. Oh, how the thread of fate unwinds to bring us together, friend. Oh, loads of lore. It hangs over the breeze with each fresh breath I take. An unknown foulness settles in my lungs. What is this? Another curse? The shroud, you say? A malignant fog to suffocate the foolish and brave. Such mortal matters hardly faze those who rise beyond. You and I, flame-touched as we are, will carry on nonetheless. <clears throat> The north wind carried them downstream. They hail from the faraway crags, monolithic and stalwart, cyclopic a gaze peering towards the dancing gusts of light on the horizon, drawn to the shimmers like moths to a flame, and fatefully greedy. They fled once burnt and hollowed by the curse. Do not show them mercy. They'd crush you to dust given the chance. Ooh, gosh, okay. Look at this comfort level 54. And we had, um... Even death has a heart. Ooh, no, that's creepy. Um, uh, we had comfort level 4 upstairs in that dungeon. All right, let's see what this guy wants. You will definitely have to deal with more hollow dungeons here, yeah, I know. Do you need a potion? Uh, well, you've got something new. Let's see what you've got. Oh, it's this glowing substance. Let's make one, because it keeps asking me about it. About the collector. Mm. I tasked you to visit the Hollow Halls, so I fear our new associate is partly my doing. I'm going to leave him in here with you. Uh, you know I walk back of a path of light. This individual lingers in the shadows. Shelter for all, of course, but I advise caution. This creature... Twists the strands of fate and ties them into a chaotic swirl. Such dark energy. I wonder how they've obtained such powers. Oh, thank you, Immortal. Thank you. Safe travels. Yeah, he's creepy. I'm going to make um, a little doorway at the back there and dig into the ground. And I've got the the bone um crypt lined building blocks and then um, yeah i think we'll make him a little crypt what well you asked me to come over <sighs> your newest friend is yours alone they have the stench of decay on them seeping from their robes and breath i watch them they linger near the altar 
glare at the fire, at the cinders and ash. I see no reflection in their eyes, no light. Gives me shivers like old Howling Pike did. So much lovely lore in this game. I, I do think it's fantastic. Right, let's go and get the bone. Um, the bone building blocks. Maybe we'll make a little crypt down there for our new friends. <laughs> Shaman, you get off to get coffee. You're getting drifty. You're drifting off. I don't blame you. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> Um, right, let's put some stuff away. Oh god, look at all this crap now. This is the only thing about games like this. I want everything to be stored away. Quickly. Without me having to sort through it. I'm going to need the hammer. But luckily I have a little shortcut key. Uh, which I should be able to just spam once I open the chest, of course. There we go. Oh, it's been so long since I played this game, which was part of the problem when we were down there in the crypts. Um, when you've been playing for a while, it's just you don't even think about what you're doing. But if you haven't played for ages, it's like, how much can I get away with here? What do I need to concentrate on? How much can I push it before running away? I think I did okay kind of funneling them into smaller groups to deal with. I think that worked pretty well for me. Oh, look at all that crap. I've got to find somewhere for all of this now. Um, oh, I've got food in there. I saw that, that meal in there then. So here are the bone blocks that I thought we might be able to use. There's a little bit in there. Uh, just a fair warning, the last hollow dungeon is the worst. That's where you have to face giant skeletons. Oh my god. <laughs> Yikes. Alright, so these are all kind of... Mm, creepy... Um, creepy magic stuff. Let's put that in there too. Oh my god, I keep dropping things on top of each other. So we've got the hollow holes block, we've got the bone block, that's the staff, put that away. Um, you can't, you can't harvest that can you? What is this? Ice protection lotion? Lotion? Let's put those in there. Uh, I guess that can go in there because that's kind of creepy. And I have that, I've got this, this, I've got some extra bones, I'll take those downstairs with me. We've got a key. Right, okay, I think I'm kind of sorted, I think I know what I'm doing now. So in here, we can put the staff back. Mm. We did pretty well with that food, I've got to say. Let's put that key away in here for now. Um, yeah, I was I was wondering that whether it is doable solo or not. Um, doesn't really fill you with confidence, does it? Once you've been through one once. Uh, flask of the fell, wisp of light. Let's take some of those out with me, and we can put this away in here. Whoa, what did I just pull? There we go. And I should have rings and other things in here. Um, I did pretty well with the arrows. Didn't use too many. I wouldn't mind making some more copper. Uh, I guess we could put that mace in there for now. All right. Let's see what we've got here. Um, yeah, you can just go in there for now. We'll put the bones in here as well. I like the look of the wand, I've got to say. We've got a level 20 with 40 damage. This one is an epic. I want to upgrade this. Let's get the runes. Oh, you're getting the same issue. Yeah, 69 likes, really? 
70 likes now. God damn it, I missed it. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> nice. Yeah, they move the cursor and they keep dropping them everywhere too. You're getting the same issue. Right, runes. Where did I see those? Let's get that upgraded and see what this looks like. Because it looks so cool. Look at it. A blunt. That one's a fire. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's try and upgrade this one then. Yeah, the skeletons. I read that. I read that out when we were down there. Uh, enhance equipment. Right, ice magic damage. More damage against the hollow. Another ice magic damage. How many have I got left? Hopefully we've got enough. It's only a level 13 wand, unfortunately, but it does look cool. 25 damage, okay. So this one at the moment is 40 damage. Okay, so it's nowhere near as much, but... It is ice damage, which is something I've not played with before. I've only got 31 runes left. That's a shame. Um, I need more arrows. Let's put these runes away. They go in here. Bronze arrow, poison arrows. Okay, I don't know if I have any um, copper. Oh, we'll go and find out. I love the, the potted plants. Look at them. How cute they look. Alright, let's go and see if we can uh, get some more arrows made. I'm glad he's in a, a room on his own. Arrows, please. I would like some copper arrows. Uh, yes, we do have enough. I guess I should really be using these now, but honestly, the um, the copper arrows are, are enough for most things. Uh, okay, so let's do a little bit of a, a bit of building here if we can. I can remember what to do, and we'll move him backwards. Oh, he's creepy. He's so creepy. Right tab. Oh no. No, no. Um, edit undo. What is undo? Why? All right, let's do alt and let's get a full block, I guess. Nope. I want probably... Yeah, that one. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Hmm. Oh, that's like a half, isn't it? Okay. Is there a full, a full square? I'm sure, there used to be. Terrain. I need terrain for that. No, that's not what I want. Let's give me a sec. I guess I could probably do it this way. Um, how do I rotate again? Uh, R, okay. So if I build that, that's what that looks like. I don't like that, actually. Hmm. Hang on a second. I think I'm going to need some of the other blocks. Yeah, there's rounded windows and doors now, so you can make little hobbit houses, <laughs> which is really cool. Let me get, I don't know, what have I used down there? Is it a regular stone block? I don't think it was the limestone block. That'll do. That'll do for now. Right, okay. So interestingly, where where has it dug? Where have I made a hole? Because I thought I saw some daylight. Is that it there? Yeah, it should be, shouldn't it? Okay, let's try this again. Pretty sure. 
Uh, so if I switch to, no, control to switch to that, I guess. And then let's pick, wasn't there a great big square cube you could pick rather than digging it out like this, like a foundation? Ah, that's what I'm wanting. It looks different, doesn't it? Okay. Um, why can't I craft that? Do I not have enough? I need 256. You're kidding. Okay. Control, bear with me. Okay. So, big foundation. That only looks like half a foundation. They've done this differently, haven't they? There we go, that's what we want. Let's get a bit further in. I want to dig sort of a, a section for him. So um, let's see if we can make stairs down. I guess we want to probably get him a little further in than he than he is now. See what we'll put that in. I'm not much liking the choices I've got here. Um he put that in build and remove. Yes. Okay, that's kind of what I want. <laughs> we'll put him We'll put him in a in a hole here. That works, doesn't it? Um, I need light. Let's take one of those um potion potions that we've got here. Uh, use. That might help. That does help. Okay, good stuff. So tap and let's put down a foundation. Uh. I guess that's where that needs to go. Yeah, that's good. Not enough space. Okay. There and remove. Uh oh. Undo. Why? Undo. No. Why? Undo. Why does it keep doing that? Bear with me. This is tricky sometimes, especially when you've not done it for a while. How's that? Yeah, that's better. Okay, let's move this through. Interesting that it won't let me build. I need to go further back. I need to cut that out with something. Not in a free space. I want this thing to be... Interesting. Okay, let's try it again. I mean, is this a big enough place for him, maybe? Maybe this is good enough. Hmm. Oh, that is a full floor. You put it in the right spot. A full height ceiling, I mean. Oh, that's awkward. Um, undo that. Let me, I've got snapping on, so it really should be a bit easier than this. See, why is that one gone? Look, that one's gone full height and this one hasn't. Hmm. Let's try again. Goodness, I forgot how tricky this can be, especially in a small... Yeah, more practice. In a small area, for sure. Okay, let's do that there. And we'll put a nice doorway in here, but I don't know why I can't get that the same way. He's in the way there. I need to move him. Uh, it doesn't allow you to build further out. That means you need to upgrade your flame. No, I've got a massive area for the flame. 
Definitely not that. Unless that area of the flame... Unless it doesn't reach that far over, maybe. Should we just put him in the cupboard? Kind of thinking I'm going to put him in a cupboard. Let's do a ceiling. Um, can we do a ceiling in here? Wow, it's so weird the way it snaps around. Let's go and have a look. I think I've got more than enough for my um my flame area. Whoa, okay. Yeah, here we go. I've got the hammer in my hand. That's where it goes to. This far. It goes all the way over here. And I've definitely not built out that far. <laughs> it goes all the way down here. Yeah, we've not we've not got that far. Definitely you should have plenty of room. And even this way, which is the way that it's wanting to go, it's got to here. And I would not think that we've reached this edge yet, so it should not be an issue of the flame area. I think it's just me forgetting how to uh, how to build. Um, let's see if we can put down some sort of doorway. Uh, yeah, so maybe this. Rotate. Need to get that in first, I guess. That's actually pretty good like that, isn't it? Yeah, I've got to move this. So let me, uh see what's in here nothing in there so let's pick this up um bit of bit short of room in here now let's put this here backpack oh well that's i did not want to put that straight down um oh my goodness um i'm so sorry I was not looking at chat because I was concentrating and I think I've missed, um, Kevin! Hello! God, I missed a load of chat! Hello, everyone! <laughs> Sorry about that. You're going to make a hobbit house? Yeah, I think you should, so that's a good idea. Hi, Kevin, how you doing? I'm glad I made some of the stream. I'm glad you're here too. Um... Let me have a look back through, see if I missed anything. Lots of bees from Kevin, thank you. Uh, I think I've caught up, but Kevin, thank you so much, has gifted five gift memberships uh, to Ninja, ZXR, Cam Smith, Danielle, Wilfred, and Dan Daniel, a different Danielle, I think. And then I think another five gift um memberships thank you so much kevin uh josh do thomas hunt steph and tara s and rick hemingway as well and surely not another five gift memberships to zeros sonny coughlin uh code sage dmc dreadfell and jonathan sniders thank you so much i'm just gonna drop a note in the chat Thank you so much, Kevin. That's so, so very generous of you. That's amazing. So sorry I was distracted with my building there. Let me give you a B. Good bees. Pop that in chat for you. Thank you so much, Kevin. Wait, let me get back on with building. <laughs> uh, right, okay. So I want to pick this back up again. Thank you, Kevin. That's very, very kind of you. Right, that's that. Awesome. Okay, so. Hammer. Let's see if we can get these bone walls installed. I'm going to take another one of these. Right, let's have a look what we can do down here. Um, this is not very even. I really don't like what I've done. 
Let's remove and remove. Let's do this again. Let's try and do it a little better this time. That doesn't look too bad, does it? I think we need a floor. Uh, let's do a ceiling. Put that down. Yep, yeah, that's good. That's good. And we need to put that there and then remove. Okay, that's a little better, isn't it? Thank you so much again, Kevin. That's really kind of you. How's that? And the bone crypt walls. Let's get those in because, you know, this is this is him all over, isn't it? Number two. Uh, yeah, that looks good. So why are you disappearing? Let's get that there. Gosh, the way it snaps, it's weird. Did you hear him? Did you hear him with his um his lantern then? Oh, that's freaky. I bet I've not got enough now. God damn it, I don't. Okay, so let's make this a feature wall then at the end. Uh, and behind him, which he doesn't know about, is um a, a secret area behind there. <laughs> Oh gosh, okay. Right, so let's change to the hollow halls block again. And we want you... Yes, we want that there. Let's stand down here. Standing in the right place it seems to be the key. Well, I think this is this is a tiny, tiny little area for this guy. But he's so freaking spooky. Uh, right, how can I make that line up? Probably there. Yeah, and there. Have I messed this up in here now? No! Um, undo. Yeah, messed that up there. Okay. Oh god, it's been too long. I've not I've not built anything in so long that I'm really out of practice here. Okay, so I want that probably there. Let's see if that's better. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Thank you, Thor. That's very good of you. And thank you again, Kevin. Very kind of you. Right, what do we think? Is this spooky enough for this guy? He's creepy. Look how dark it is down here. We'll have to make him some lights. Okay. We get in there. We get in there. Let's make him a ceiling. Roof. Um. It's not happy. Oh, I need... Um, I know what it's doing trying to actually make a roof but I want a floor up there I guess we might need to just leave it dirt I mean it's kind of in keeping with the crypt isn't it I guess I can't figure out how to place this we'll leave it as dirt where has that snapped to okay I don't know where that snapped so we'll just leave it we'll leave it without a roof then Oh. oh, thank you, Kevin. No, I do have to thank you. <laughs> it's so very kind of you. No, I I know, Seb. I, I can un, um, unsnap. The problem is, it's... um. If you look here... Ah, oh, mind you, that is, that is a little easier. I wonder why it was... Yeah, that is a little better. I wonder why it's doing that, though. Yes, thank you. That has worked better. <laughs> You're right. God, blow me. But thank you. That was a very nice way of offering that advice as well. <gasps> no! Let's use that. So vital for building, it really is. 
Oh, it's creepy roof. Looks good. Um, let me just make sure I've not gone outside here with that one. Nope, we're good. Uh, it hasn't quite gone all the way, but I guess we could put a little bit more in there. Uh, mm. What I'm worried about is what is it's doing outside. Let's go and have a look outside. We might have all sorts of stuff in the lawn out, out here now. Uh, I think we are good. This is where it would come out, isn't it? Uh, is it? Bear with me, let me check. Is it possible to make a bone chair? Yeah, there's all sorts of um, weird and wonderful things to craft. So I go, look how dark and ho horrible it is down there. That's so cool. Okay, so it would definitely be here. If it was sticking up through the ground, we'd definitely see it here, wouldn't we? Yep, okay, I think we're good. So, next thing is, do we make the creepy... Creepy crypt guy. What sort of door do we make him? He would look good with weird chair. Yeah, it's a, it's like a throne though, and I'm thinking it's too good for him because he's really creepy. Um. See, the thing is, carved wooden door. These are so nice. Stone double door. That's pretty cool. I'd need two stone doors. They, ne they take bronze. I'm not using bronze on that creepy fella. If you look here, that's the only option I think I've got for the door frames. Um, I don't have the round door frames on this building block. Unless I'm looking at it wrong. I've not built any of the um, of the round doors yet. Let's just see what options we've got here. No round one for that either. Maybe it's just wood. Um, he would look really creepy with his little crypt table and all sorts of stuff, wouldn't he? I've only got a single boring front door and this guy's got a nice tomb down there. Half timbered block. Uh, that's that weird wood. Rough stone, limestone. Let's just take a couple of these and see. If we get any other options. I don't think we will, but there's no carry capacity problems here. Did I miss Dr. Deathwish leaving as well? I'm sorry, everybody. This has really got me concentrating. Have a nice day, Mitz. I have things to do. I will be back next stream. Well, if you watch this later on and catch up, hopefully uh, you got to hear my uh, my message there. Thank you so much. Right, okay. So let's try this again. Uh, so, different blocks. We want maybe to try a wooden one and see if we get any different options. No, I think all the frames are square, aren't they? Yeah, okay. So, with that said, let's switch back to the hollow halls block. Let's go and talk to the carpenter again. Where do you make the round doors? Mm. I would think they would be in here, wouldn't they? It's miscellaneous doors, windows. There are the round ones. I've seen these. These are, these are really cool. I don't know where the round doors are. <laughs> Radiant. Uh, if this is content warning, I might say Mint's voice is soothing. 
How about flowers, flower pots with dead flowers in them? That would be so cool. So much stuff we can make now. I must be missing where you can make them. I don't think they're in the workbench. I don't think so. Oh, I can make some more hollow holes block. Doors. Ah, round wooden doors. So they're very basic. And a round window frame. I gotcha. Let's make one of those, see what it looks like. Oh, okay. I thought it was a new advanced... Um, yeah, actually a secret one would look pretty pretty uh, fun, wouldn't it? Choose one of these again. And a backpack. And let's move this down. We'll just see what it looks like. Ooh, no, I don't like that. That definitely, I oh, need to take that bit of wall out completely. And because I've got it going down into the dungeon, it looks odd. So we're not going to do that. Let's make him a normal door then. Actually, let's just check that this fits first. Let's grab, oh, polished wooden door. Okay. Because if this doesn't fit, I might need to make a few adjustments, but for now, this will do. Uh, oh, it, it takes on the appearance of the thing around it, and I don't think I've quite got it lined up. Let, let me adjust this. So, building mode, we need the door frame, which we've got. Uh, God, blimey. This is difficult to remove. Okay, so that would be where the door frame and stuff needs to go then, I guess. It's kind of off to one side, but I think it'll work. That might be better. Let's try that again then. Number seven. And yeah, that fits in there now. Do we want it? Um, how do we want to fit that in? Ooh. Okay, that, that works. Yeah, look at him looking in there. He's like, is that where you're going to put me? Yeah, that's where you're going to live, fella. In this creepy hole here, because nobody likes you. They're all complaining about you, so you can you can live down there. That does work, doesn't it? Yeah. I do like the secret door idea. I'm sure I've got one somewhere, but let's make, um, well, I'll tell you what, let me just check. I've got one here somewhere. That would be fitting, I guess. Uh, yes, we've got one here. Let's try this quickly. And if not, we'll make a, we'll make another door. Oh, I've got a cramp in my foot right now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, my poor foot. Okay. All right, let's pick this up again. Oh, that's quite violent when you do that. And let's see. Uh, I'll need snapping on, I guess. That looks weird, doesn't it? Oh, we've got to do that. <laughs> we have to do that. Yep. It's a bit weird, the frame. I might change that frame um, and put in the frame with the other block that's actually in this basement already. Uh, because I think that would probably work better. Um, so... Let's see. Um, I'm in the hollow holes block, aren't I? Yeah. 
Yeah, that looks good. And then let's change the material. That one. Hmm. No, that's no good. Why? Let's take off snapping. Good grief. Okay. I need it a little further out just to cover that up a little bit more. Is that the right block? No, I don't think it is. I think I used a different block down here. Did I leave it upstairs? Bear with me a second. Oh god. Yeah, it's almost perfect. we just got to see if I can use that same block. And we'll get the um, summoning staff thing as well and we'll move that guy. Might be that one. I don't think it's you. I don't think it's you, but just in case. I have a lot of that, so it might well be that. And let's get the staff. And then we can move that fella. Okay, so we've got the door in place already. <laughs> it's so creepy the way he lifts up his uh, lantern. It's weird. So what do we think it is? It's not that, is it? Rough stone block. It's definitely not that. I don't think it's you. I don't think it's you. Fine wood block. Regular stone block. Is it regular stone block? They're not big enough, are they? I think it's this one. Yeah, it's this one. Okay. So I need this this way. Just a touch. There. Good grief. There. Could move it back a little, get rid of the... It, yeah, it, that is right. Okay, well this is in the wrong place, so we'll pick you up. The only thing I don't like is I've got that there and this thing's run out again, bear with me. I can't build without this, it's too dark down here. I might have to move that... Um, that back to where it was but we'll we'll see if we can get this to work okay and then i need to get rid of that there that red um area so let's move this back down and what we can do is we can use these tiny blocks and try and get rid of these here Let's see if this works and I'll just put another bit of wall in in its place and hopefully you won't even know that was there uh, it looks like there's something down here to get rid of uh, yep how about that I mean, the, the door's not exactly a match, but it doesn't look too bad. Um, sorry, I've not been looking at chat again. Sorry. Hi, Digger. <laughs> Hello. Good to see you. We've been adventuring in the hollow halls today. What do we think, guys? It's not perfect. I can maybe try and maneuver some things around again well, it looks like we've got a couple of spaces here to fill in as well tab let's change to the other block hollow halls block and see if we can fill these bits in yep that looks neater That definitely looks better. How did you do in the hollowed halls? I did really well. Um, well, 
reasonably well. <laughs> Didn't die. It was okay. It was um, a lot. There were a lot of values, I have to say. A lot more than I was expecting. I'm happy with that, I think, for the moment. So let's move this, this guy inside. Um, did I not bring up the staff? There he is. So let's uh, cycle through. Uh, we need this fella at the bottom. Now let's move him down here because he is creepy. And yeah, we'll put you right there. There you go. Should be at home. Don't move. <laughs> nice. Oh my god, yeah, there was a lot of flying around. It was um Poof My 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 uh nemesis. I, I do not like the flying when there's a risk, you know? Not too bad if it's just Oh, if I put that like that, I think that looks better. Is that kind of stuck in the wall or not? Yeah, flying um, and being accurate when you're flying is not my forte. <laughs> what do we think of this door? Do you think it needs moving? Forgot he was in there. Look at him. Alright, let's put that down here. And... So I could stick it out there. But it looks very obviously like a door. I think it has to be further back, doesn't it? Because it's going to slide down into the ground. Yeah, okay. Oh, that'll do. That will do for now. So the next thing we need to do is to build some lighting. We're in there because it's so dark and creepy. Illumination. Um, what have we got? Gosh, there's so much now. Where do we build his lighting? Oh, my foot! My foot is all cramped up. Look at these lovely um lanterns we can make. Oh, we probably make it on him, don't we? Okay. No, we have our own crypt keeper. We do. Uh, you, you, you're safe now. He's behind a stone wall. Look at him down there. He's so creepy. Let's put the torch here because, you know, he's just weird. All right, craft, please. I would like some illumination because this is very dark down here. Exoplasm gem. Let's make two of those. I think we've got to get one of these standing torches. Uh, we're also going to have one of those. Uh, maybe a little bone thing down there. Let's have a look how that looks. Fade away, like dust in the wind. Shut up, you creepy man. Um, right, okay. So, let's place this. It's going to go dark when I do this. Uh, let's put that right in the corner, I guess. Needs to be a bit further over. It's all good. Okay, so maybe there will do. Oh, <laughs> he's so creepy. Uh, we got the wall one. Hmm. I don't know where to put this quite. Uh, we'll put it on this wall because when you walk in it's quite dark, isn't it? Actually, it's not bad. Look how that's lit up. It's pretty good. Let's put that maybe... Maybe there? Yeah, okay. Another creepy... Uh, Creepy thing, and then we've got like a candle we can put on the floor. I guess we could put this out here as a little sign that there's something behind the door. They go in the corner. There we go, how about that? 
Oh no, no, I don't want to be in here with him. No, I like the green glow too. Hi. Yeah, that, that really works. Oh my God. You have a foot massager. Oh, I, I don't know why. It's the top of my foot that's actually cramped up. It's so weird. Make sure to light his best sides. Definitely a t-shirt <laughs> quotes. I kind of want to leave him down there in the darkness. Do you know what I mean? Um, let's see what it looks like. No, it, need, it does need something in there. Look at him down the end. Okay, let's do this again then. Put him there. Get the staff. There. It always confuses me um, that it has their little picture. Um, let's put him... What I want him to do is I want him to use his lantern a little. Just in case we need to put him like a, a table here or a chair or whatever. Let's put him a little bit further out. Oh, look. You can see the, the soil. I don't think that matters, though. Not when the door's shut, anyway. Good. Okay. Right, so let's get rid of all these blocks. I'm glad we've got these um, bone blocks now. They work brilliantly for that. Not sure about that door. Really not sure about that door. I'll put my arrows back down there. Okay, so um, the other thing is, I guess, maybe we could make him a, a chair. Let's have a look. Chairs. Ectoplasm gem. So this is the crypt chair, which we can definitely put in there. These tables are not going to fit. And I'm not wasting metal sheets on him, I'm sorry. So let's just give him a chair for now. Shut up. Don't say things like that, you weirdo. He's a creep. There we go, you got a chair. I could sit on there. Oh, that's so spooky. Yeah, I look scared to death. <laughs> Get out of there. Oh. Uh, I was picking up Sage um, before the update, yeah. I think I've got some in storage. Too bad you can't make a bone door. Yeah, I know. Needs something, doesn't it? I could probably try and um, work on some more creepy, uh, creepy stuff to go around. Get back out into the daylight, shall we? Let's put these bone blocks away. And um, I think today... I think I'm going to call it at three hours. We've been going for two hours, 49 minutes. And that dungeon thing was quite a lot. <laughs> so I think I'll uh, put this stuff away. Maybe we could just have a look at the other crafting items. See what else there is to craft. Gosh, G. What does G do? Sort, okay. Um, let's put the door in there. Put our torch back down. Oh, I'm gonna probably put this bow away because I bought an extra bow with me just in case. Uh, that doesn't go in there. It goes in this one, I think. I can go in there now. I really don't know where I was keeping it before. Yep, okay, and that is where these two things go. Yeah, I want to try that one out. Maybe we'll just go and try and find somebody quickly to uh, to go and bother. 
Um, yes, the eclipse is happening soon anyway, so you guys need to all get off and uh, and go and check that out, I'm sure. So this works for me. I'll go and get some lunch. I love... I, oh, look at this. Look at the glow. <gasps> look at the bones around the, the wands. That is so cool. Oh my god, I love it. You didn't get any until the update. Um, let me just check. I think I've got sage in here. Uh, which one is the one with all the recipe stuff in? All the ingredients. Is it here? This one? Not in there. It might be in the garden plot outside. Uh, ruby, stinging nettles, sage. Yeah, and I've not been anywhere. I've not played the update until now. So yeah, we definitely had sage before. Kindle wastes and all that stuff. I think it was, uh, if I remember correctly, it wasn't quite as far. It wasn't this far. It was more in this sort of an area, I think. When you come through the Pillars of Creation, the sage is somewhere in this sort of area. If I remember correctly. But look at the, the wand. That is incredible. I love that effect. So clever. What time is the eclipse? I don't know. I think somebody said it was about 2pm your time, I think. So you've got like an hour or two, maybe. Depends where you are. Am I doing my inventory? Let me just check. Yeah, I've put most things away. Let me just very quickly find somebody to go and shoot um, before we finish. Sun Temple. Let's go here. Thank you, John. Hi, Johnny. How you doing? At 12.18 CDT and goes into totality at 1.36 CDT. For 4 minutes 13 seconds. Amazing. Oh, I forgot how creepy this place is, actually. Look at this. Why on earth? Oh, no, look what I did. I started something here, haven't I? So it's not really very effective at all. Look how many shots that took. Just to kill that one scorpion. Not very good at all. Fire is much better against them. Little bugger. Nice, okay. So yeah, it uh, seems to work fine, but not, not really effective against these enemies for sure. I love the sound of this area, it's amazing. Definitely better with the fire ones. Nice, good. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna travel back home. And I think that's where we'll call it a day. Uh, Sally and I will be back on Wednesday with more Valheim. So that's good. I'm looking forward to that. We're going to try and get some more um, iron, I think, for, uh, for upgrades. And uh, we've had fun today. I absolutely loved the hollowed dungeon. That was a lot of fun. Uh, lots and lots and lots of enemies. I will probably need to prepare a little better for the next one because I think that's going to be even harder. Uh, and we've done a bit of building. We've made our own creepy crypt guy, which I think is uh, amazing. I, I just want to check he's still down there because, you know, he seems a bit sus. The dungeon was definitely more creepy. That's not bad, you know, when you walk in. I mean, you can definitely see there's something there. But that's not bad. Oh, look, he blends into the wall in the background. Creepy. 
Yeah, the amount of skeletons in that dungeon compared to Valheim when you run through the swamp, for example, or something, and you've got all the skellies after you. I think uh, they did a good job with that dungeon. I really enjoyed it. Uh, anyway, thank you everyone so much for being here today. I had a great time. Loved having your company. Hope you all enjoy the uh, eclipse. I shall look forward to seeing some footage of that on the news, I guess. Uh, if anybody wants to put any pictures in Game Edge Discord, I'll check them out in there. Uh, but yeah, have a great day, everyone. Not a bad start to the week, eh? Total Eclipse, Hello Dungeon. A nice cup of tea and a bit of cake or something. Thank you for being here, everyone. Welcome, Seb. Good to see you. Thank you for your help as well earlier. Um, and uh, who else was it who uh, told me to look up? I can't remember who it was, but thank you so much. You saved that section. Oh, I was so confused for a while there. Anyway, I am uh, I am off. Have a great day and I'll see you on Wednesday, hopefully. Bye for now. Bye.